I'm Brad Paisley. This is the new Brad Paisley Signature Esquire. Why an Esquire? The aggression from one pickup, one steel bridge, brass saddles, tuners, nothing in the way, great piece of wood. There's nothing like it. However, right here, there's a little secret gadget, kind of like a spy gadget that I think you're gonna love. We kind of started talking about, myself and Seymour Duncan, about the idea of a neck pickup that's hidden, that doesn't take away from the overall aggressive vibe of an Esquire. So hidden underneath of this pick guard right here is a pickup specifically designed to pick up the strings without pulling too much on them and allowing the full sort of free vibration that happens with a with a Esquire typically. So it sounds like this. That is not something you can typically do with an Esquire. What you've got is a guitar that is really, really heavily focused on the bridge and on that thing that happens with a Telecaster that is a combination of magnetics and metal and wood and resonance and this connectivity between the neck and this bridge plate. And you don't have the sort of encumbrance of a pickup that's pulling down on these strings up here in a typical fashion. It's allowed everything to sort of just completely aggressively go between this cable and your amplifier, and it's just a punch in the face. It's always important to me that you hear an echo of the past in the stuff that I do. The first finish that we did, which was the Silver Sparkle, was born out of my love for the influence of people like Buck Owens and Don Rich. They were the first to sort of stand up there in these sparkly, just crazy hillbillied out guitars and play really twangy country music. When they sent me the idea to do this Black Sparkle I fell in love with this. This looks, as a West Virginian, this looks like you've been mining for coal with this guitar. It looks like you're, it's half diamonds, half coal on this thing. Uh, there's something country about this. This, this body is a polonia body with a spruce cap that has more resonance than I think most tone woods you'll ever hear. Polonia feels a lot like some of the lightest swamp ash that you'll find. And in that sense, it behaves, I think, similarly tone-wise. And so you needed the right combination, the right windings, the right output on a pickup that sort of I guess enhances what this wood's already doing. To take that thing that happens with that silver telly that we already made and turn it into an Esquire with Seymour's pickup here is really taking it another level up as far as twang. You have the guitar of a lifetime. If you want to get another guitar, you can, but you don't need to. There's something hidden. And it sparkles under the lights, so you can't ask for more than that.